Hi everyone, it's Anna for Pretty Actions, and today I want to talk to you about storing your Photoshop actions somewhere besides your computer, like in your cloud storage or on an external hard drive or thumb drive. So this is really, really important for you to do, and I cannot stress how important that is, um, because you never know when, God forbid, something will happen to cause you to lose your information on your computer. And it doesn't even have to be that dramatic, though. Say you just purchased a new computer and you want to move all of your Photoshop actions and overlays to your new computer, you're going to need the original file folders that contain the .atn files in order to transfer them to your new computer. We see so many people in our Facebook group and in the forum that haven't properly backed up their actions and they end up losing them. So for that reason, it's a really good practice to back up your Photoshop action overlay files to a location that's separate from your main computer or hard drive. So IT professionals are usually going to tell you to back up your files with the 321 method, which is storage across three devices on two different types of devices, such as one computer and one external hard drive or jump drive, and one off-site, such as cloud storage. So, like I was saying before, one option for storing your Photoshop files is through your cloud-based storage companies like iCloud, Google Drive, and of course Dropbox. So, a lot of uh, companies will give you free storage up to a certain amount of gigs, and since your pretty actions come in a zipped file, the free accounts that these companies provide are typically more than enough storage to store your actions. So all you'll need to have are your original ATN, .atn files and you'll be able to upload those directly to platforms such as Dropbox. Now another option is to transfer them to an external hard drive or jump drive and you'll need to store the original zip files that you downloaded from Pretty Actions in a convenient and easy to locate spot on your hard drive. So I store mine under Documents, Pretty Actions, Collections and here you'll see all of my original action file folders. So to move them, you can simply select them and drag and drop them to your external device or copy and paste. So there you have it. Those are two really simple ways that you can store your uh, .atn files and also your JPEGs for your um, haze, light, and sun flare, and of course your cloud overlays.